Welcome to my channel IT Smart Training. Today we are going to configure how to enable authentication in GC video conference server. If this video is informative, please like the video and subscribe this channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get more up to date. Let's start the lab. step by step guide uh, the installation or not installation is a uh, configurations of uh, uh, authentication when we connect a video conference server it will prompt to authenticate so I just go step by step at first I have to go etc prosody connected conf dot avail and then go to uh, and then go to smartlab dot ddns uh, dot net dot cfg dot lua I just open I have to open this file and here I have I just go down and next I just found I just I have to find this authentication here you can see the authentication is showing you just change it to anonymous to internal underscore plain and saved it done now I have to go the SIP communicator properties this is the function provided by SIP gateway module in Gigasi which did not yet installed I just go here and go to next line here I have to provide this one when it uh, when any uh, call is connect then it will prompt to authenticate so I just uh, add this uh, line over here and saved it done next I just restart those service prosody jikofo and the video bridge it's done now you can check that the video conference prompt the username and password if you go here I just refresh the browser once and I can create a new uh, meeting or I can add a existing meeting also and just click on go see here it is prompt the username and password over here ok so I just minimize it and next I have to create a user to login proceed to registered admin smartlab dot here is a invalid domain name is mapped here I have smartlab dot ddns dot net I have to change it here dns.net this was my last uh, domain which is uh, wrongly mapped here so I just create this user created user created done now you just go here and type admin and provide password 1234 see that the video conferencing running okay with the password now I configure the anonymous conference join so how to configure it go to ATC prosody config just go this file 
and there I have to add a new section this part just go bottom of the file and I just paste this one guest dot smart lab dot ddns dot net and authentication is anonymous c2s required encryption equals to false control o x exit done next i have to go here etc jigasi smart lab dot ddns dot net config dot js go there here I have to add anonymous domain okay so here you can find that anonymous domain is written over here just change it to example just replace the example.com to your domain name I just copy the domain name paste done control O to save exit done next I have to restart the Prasody service Jikofa service and video based service done so authentication setup is done so I just refresh once again I just create a test meeting I am entering the test meeting directly I am inside the room and if I create here I can add password so I just uh, uh, previously I just create uh, create is uh, uh, for the guest user anonymous so it is uh, useful to join a meeting without having a password so if somebody in before the con before configuring this okay before configuring this uh, this part was a security of the Jitsi Meet server where we mentioned that everybody should who have created the uh, meeting so they must uh, go to the uh, go to provide the username and password and when they are logged in uh, or the join to the meeting they also have to provide the username and password then only the meeting will start and in this part I am just configure the anonymous join means somebody I'm uh, somebody create uh, somebody who can create the meeting they can join with the uh, username and password and after that the others members though are uh, the member of the conference they are just go there and uh, join uh, with the password okay so if you uh, provide the meeting password you can also password here and you can share it also here so in this way you can configure the authentication so thank you if you like my videos please subscribe my channel